Now look, man. I this I ain't even gonna waste time. I got I had a I got a lot of hope that the Ravens can win the win the Super Bowl. Uh, I pretty much know that we're capable to win the Super Bowl. We got the talent to win the Super Bowl. We got the the, the defense to win the Super Bowl. The defense is stout. The defense is magnificent. We got a uh, we got the quarterback to win the Super Bowl. He has the talent. Lamar Jackson has the talent that it takes to be able to win the Super Bowl. Um. We had injuries at running back. We found we found other pieces. Gus Edwards runs hard. Justice Hill runs hard. He he fumbles. Uh, I don't care for him as much as others, but he runs hard. Keaton Mitchell came out of nowhere, runs pretty daggone hard. Um, defense suffered injuries and still still manages to lead the league in sacks, lead the league in this, and lead the league in that. We, we're monsters. Plus we got Hawk 'em down. Over oh, in the in the middle going crazy. Patrick Queen having his best year yet. It's it's it's, it's all lined up to, to to for Super Bowl potential. Um, Sunday against the Browns is a uh, it's disgusting work. It's 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 choking at its best, and it's why it's why you lose confidence in saying in, in knowing. Cause saying it is one thing, but I be feeling like I know we're gonna win the bowl. But these are the things that will make you lose confidence. Blowing the lead that we blew in that fourth quarter is disgusting. And um, while it's not all Lamar Jackson's fault, one of the things that has to be talked about that I feel like we don't do, we don't, we we we, we try to we baby step with Lamar a lot. I haven't talked all year, and I don't. This is not a Lamar hate show. This is why I haven't even dropped too many videos this year because I'm trying to wait it out and see what happened and I've been busy anyway so I haven't been able to execute my videos how I want to execute them so I've just been chilling sitting back just watching betting losing money on FanDuel but anyway um yeah this isn't a, isn't a just Lamar thing but what we are not going to do we're not going to act like he don't have the turnovers that he has which is like 15 he got like 10 picks and five from you got like it's mad turnovers bro it's a it's it's, it's abundance of turnovers all a lot of them in, a lot of them are in clutch moments for i.e fourth quarter um with less than eight to ten minutes left like a, it's, it's like these things can't happen this is how you lose this is how you don't win the super bowl when you have a defense that we have the little only thing you cannot do is turn the ball over let alone pick six now i know people will say we're quick to we're quick to defend so it's easy to say oh the ball got tipped and yeah that would that would be easy to say if he had two picks on the air i.e cj shroud if he had five six picks, it, you know you know what i'm saying he has an, he has interceptions man he's made terrible throws that that's cost us against the Steelers. That throw to Odell Beckham in the red zone was probably the dumbest throw I've seen all year. One of the dumbest all year, and this came from an MVP caliber quarterback. These things had. This is not me hating Lamar. This is not me bashing him. I, I've been loving him this year. He's been playing great. He's he for the most part. His decision making for the most part has been way better, especially when we went on the road against these NFC teams and went to London and stuff like that. His decision making is crazy. He's been doing very well. But we're not going to sit and act like if we don't take another step up, we're going to fall short again. Because it's facts. If we don't take that, we got one more step to take. And that's mistake free ball. Things happen in football. But these fumbles and these crazy ass interceptions pick six and not this it has to be it it has to it has to cease it's already been way too much of it now i'm hoping we're getting it all out our system and it'll and it'll be over but how do we know this for sure we literally don't know it for sure we don't know all we know is what we've seen in the playoffs we've seen nothing but choke jogs from the ravens and lamar jackson I'm saying the Ravens and Lamar Jackson because I don't want to even deal with the, oh, I'm hating the Lamar Khan. I, I don't even want to deal with it because I've had plenty of chances to slander him. I've also had plenty of chances to praise him. That's why I'm doing a little bit of both in this video. All I'm saying is, bro, I'm really a Ravens fan. I bleed this shit. My feelings is attached every year even though I try to detach them. 
I just want us to play the best ball we can play. And these crazy, goofy turnovers, these these are turnovers that that rookies make. These are these are things like this. This this isn't a any given Sunday type situations that we're losing by. We're, we're beating ourselves. We're gonna beat ourselves right out of the Super Bowl. I don't want to see that again. I don't want to see that again. The, all the losses that we have, these guys I have 90% chance of winning in the fourth. Yeah, you could blame the defense, but the defense hold up all game. But the offense have to be able to move the ball when it count. Have to. Just got to happen. I'm just a Ravens fan, man. I just wanted to get it off my chest. Shout out to Lamar. Shout out to the Ravens. We've been balling out of control. I like what we're doing on the defensive side. I like I like the offense. I like where we're going. The play the play calling has been getting progressively better. The decision making from everyone is getting progressively better. But if we don't be real with ourselves and cut and tell and understand that these turnovers have if they if they don't cut short, it's over. We're gonna lose. This year is a toss up. Hell, the AFC North, everyone got the same damn record, I think. This year's a goddamn toss up. It's gonna come down to who's who's not gonna turn the ball over. That's literally what this this year is gonna come down to. I hope we're all I hope you're all watching to see. This year will come down to who's gonna turn the ball over the most. Guess what? The Bills, they won't be there. I'm watching them but turn the ball over now. They can't score. It's gonna come down to it. And guess what? Patrick Mahomes probably gonna end up being in another Super Bowl because he's gonna make the least amount of mistakes. But if he makes but if he makes mistakes, guess where he's gonna be? He's at the point where if he make one mistake, he's adios amigos. The Chiefs not that good. So it's a it's a damn toss up. You got people talking about CJ Stroud might be winning the MVP sometime soon. He might be winning the MVP this year. Come on, man. We gotta hold. We gotta hold out. We gotta hold this accountable. We can't let another year of a great defense go to waste. Kyle Hamilton is having the best year of his career. He's a short career, but he, bro, he's looking like one of the best safeties in the league right now. Geno Stone is a backup. He wasn't even expected to play. He's looking like one of the best safeties in the league right now. Marlon Humphreys is coming back from injury. You know what he's gonna do. Brandon Stevens is looking like a a, a great um, corner right a, Not great but a real good second corner right now Really good A real good quality second corner right now Hawk him down That's Hawk him down Patrick Queen is literally looking like A star middle linebacker On any other team right now We we have the most sacks In the league We haven't done that In, in, in probably a decade We cannot let it go to waste. The turnovers must cease. I don't give a f what we gotta do. The turnovers must cease. I'm just a Ravens fan. I'm out of here.